Welcome to Auto Bike Review, where we dive deep into the world of machines that define power, innovation, and engineering excellence. Today, we're turning our attention to a fighter jet that represents a giant leap forward in Indian aviation technology, the 2025 HAL Tejas Men K2. This aircraft is not just an upgrade of its predecessor, but a reimagined platform designed to compete with some of the most advanced fighters in the world. The Tejas Men K2 is India's response to the evolving demands of modern aerial warfare, bringing in enhanced range, payload, avionics, and stealth features. It symbolizes self-reliance under the Make in India initiative, while also positioning itself as a credible alternative in the global defense market. Evolution of the Tejas Program The Tejas Program began decades ago with the vision of replacing India's aging fleet of MiG-21 fighters. The initial Tejas Ming K-1 proved India's capability to design and manufacture a supersonic multi-role fighter. But it was clear that more power, better endurance, and greater versatility were needed. This set the stage for the Tejas Ming K-2. Unlike its predecessor, the MK-2 is not a light fighter but sits firmly in the medium weight class. It bridges the gap between the lighter Tejas Ming K-1 and heavier fighters like the Sukhoi Su-30 MKI. The MK-2 is the culmination of lessons learned, technological advancements, and global collaboration. It marks a shift from experimental indigenous fighter to a robust, combat-ready platform capable of shaping future air dominance. Design and Airframe Enhancements One of the most significant transformations in the Tejas Meng 2 lies in its design and airframe. While retaining the delta wing configuration, the MK-2 features modifications to increase internal fuel capacity, giving it extended range and endurance. The fuselage has been stretched, the wings slightly enlarged, and additional hard points integrated to carry heavier and more diverse weapon loads. Composite materials continue to play a major role, reducing weight while increasing strength and radar absorption. The airframe is optimized for reduced radar cross-section, with refined shaping and coatings that lend its semi-stealth characteristics. This design evolution ensures the MK-2 is agile, survivable, and adaptable in high-threat environments. Engine Power and Performance at the heart of the Tejas Masses II is the powerful General Electric F-414 GE in six engine, replacing the older S-404 used in the MK-1. The F-414 delivers nearly 98 kilonewtons of thrust, dramatically improving the aircraft's thrust-to-weight ratio and enabling higher payloads. This engine allows the MK-2 to reach speeds of Mach 1.8 while offering greater acceleration, climb rate, and maneuverability. Its enhanced afterburner provides the raw power needed for super agile dogfighting while also enabling long-range strike missions. The integration of this engine required major redesigns, but ensures the MK2 is not only faster, but also more versatile in tour than its predecessor. Avionics and Cockpit Systems The avionics suite of the Tejas Mum Kick 2 is designed to rival contemporary fighters from across the world. The cockpit features a wide area display system, modern head-up display, and fully digital fly-by-wire controls. Pilot workload has been reduced with advanced automation and sensor fusion, ensuring real-time battlefield awareness. The aircraft integrates an indigenous UTAM AASA radar, capable of tracking multiple targets simultaneously while resisting jamming and electronic warfare attacks. The electronic warfare suite itself is advanced, providing self-protection through jammers, countermeasures, and towed decoys. The avionics backbone ensures that the Tejas Misko Su can serve not just as a frontline fighter, but as a networked platform within a larger combat ecosystem. Weapons and payload capacity. One of the major advantages of the Tejas Mk2 is its significantly enhanced payload capacity. With 11 hardpoints compared to the MKK-1's eight, the aircraft can carry over 6.5 tons of weapons. These include a mix of air-to-air -air missiles like the Astra Mk-1 and Mk-2, as well as beyond visual range options that rival global competitors. For ground attack, it can deploy precision-guided munitions, cruise missiles, and anti-radiation missiles. It also supports integration with international weapon systems, making it attractive for export customers. A 23mm internal cannon provides additional strike capability. 
This flexibility ensures the Ming AK-2 can seamlessly switch between air superiority, strike, and maritime roles for stealth and survivability. Features Although the Tejas Mo K-2 is not a full fifth-generation stealth fighter, it incorporates stealth features to enhance survivability. Radar-absorbing materials, reduced infrared signatures, and refined design help lower its visibility to enemy radars. Advanced electronic warfare systems, combined with tow decoys and flares, provide additional layers of defense against incoming threats. The aircraft's agility allows it to perform evasive maneuvers effectively, while its avionics suite ensures the pilot's always aware of potential threats in the combat environment. This makes the MK-2 a formidable opponent even against advanced adversary fighters. Operational range and endurance. A critical limitation of the earlier Tejas Mkhis-1 was its limited combat radius. The MK-2 solves this problem with increased internal fuel capacity and the ability to carry external drop tanks without compromising performance. Its combat radius extends to over 1,500 kilometers, making it a true medium-weight fighter capable of deep strike missions. With aerial refueling capability, its endurance can be extended further, ensuring it can project power across greater distances. This expanded range makes the Tejas Menke too highly relevant for India's vast geography and regional strategic needs. Role in the Indian Air Force For the Indian Air Force, the Tejas Mon K-2 is not just a replacement for the aging MiG-29, Mirage 2000, and Jaguar fleets, but also a key component of its future force structure. It is expected to fill squadrons with a cost-effective, yet capable fighter that complements the heavier Sukhoi, Su-30 MKI, and the future AMCA 5th generation stealth fighter. The MK-2 provides flexibility, affordability, and operational readiness, ensuring that India maintains numerical strength alongside technological advancements. Its indigenous origin also reduces reliance on foreign suppliers, which is critical for long-term strategic independence. Export potential and global relevance. Beyond domestic use, the Tejas Mao K-2 is being positioned as a competitive export product. Many countries seek affordable multi-role fighters that do not compromise on modern capabilities. The MK-2 fits this need perfectly, offering advanced avionics, reliable performance, and compatibility with a wide range of weapon systems. With lower operating costs compared to Western fighters, it can attract buyers in Asia, Africa, and Latin America. If marketed effectively, the Tejas MK-2 could become a major success story for India's defense export ambitions. Future Upgrades and Roadmap the Tejas Ming K-2 is designed with growth potential in mind. Future upgrades may include more powerful indigenous engines, integration of directed energy weapons, and artificial intelligence-driven systems for autonomous operations. The modular design ensures it can adapt to changing battlefield requirements and incorporate next-generation technology as it becomes available. As a stepping stone to India's stealth AMC fighter program, the MK-2 ensures that Indian engineers, designers, and pilots gain critical experience for more complex projects ahead. Conclusion The 2025 HAL Tejas Mk-2 is more than just an aircraft. It is a statement of intent. It shows that India is not only capable of designing modern fighter jets, but also ready to compete globally in the aerospace sector. With its powerful engine, advanced avionics, greater range, and versatile weapon loadout, the MK-2 transforms the Tejas platform into a formidable medium-weight, multi-role fighter. For the Indian Air Force, it provides the right balance of performance and cost-effectiveness. While for the world, it showcases India as an emerging force in aviation technology. The Tejas MK-2 is not just an upgrade, it is the future of Indian combat aviation, ready to soar high and secure the skies.